today? Yes, happy new. Okay, so why are you absent last week? You have a camp? Last week? Yes. You went last, to camp? Yes, last week I go to camping. Okay, you went to the camping. Okay. okay. So today let us have here. We okay. have two. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so we have two point one speaking. Okay. Okay, so we have here 2.1 speaking. Okay, number one, let us ask teacher and we're going to ask you, where did you go on the holiday last year? Where did you go on the holiday last year? I went to Winyang and Nha Trang. Okay, you went to Nha Trang? Winyang and Nha Trang. Okay, is it far or no? Yeah, it's far. Okay, like how many... Uh, how many hours of travel going there? Mm, I think five family. Five three, family. Three family. Okay. Okay. So, do you enjoy sightseeing when on holiday? Yes, I do. Okay. You love to sightseeing on holiday. Where are you planning on going on the holiday next summer? Um, I will go, go to Nha Trang or Hue. You will go to Nha Trang. Okay, is it far? What, uh, is it in Hanoi or Danang, near Danang? No, it isn't. It's not near Danang. Uh, it is far? Yes. Okay, far from Danang. Okay. So, so what can you see in there? What is the tourist spot? Mm, I see a bridge and I see a bridge. You can see a? Or, a bridge. Yes, very beautiful. Okay, it's very beautiful. Wow, that's good. So this, it's what it was actually very beautiful. Okay, the bridge is very beautiful. Okay, so this one. Next one. Would you like to try surfing in the future? Mm, I would I like to try surfing is in Hanoi. In Hanoi. Okay. So which is your favorite city that you have visited? Which is your favorite city that you have visited? Yeah, uh, my my favorite city I have visited is Nha Trang. Nha Trang. Okay, what is in Nha Trang? What can you see in Nha Trang? I the beautiful beach and I eat and I eat seafood. Seafood and beautiful beach. Wow, that's nice. You eat beautiful, you eat seafoods and beautiful beach. Wow, that's nice. Okay. So next one. Okay. Which is your favorite city that you have visited at one chunk? Okay. Like you are gonna ride a train or you will gonna ride a bus? Mm, yes. A train and a bus? Mm, I I went there by a car. Ah, by a car. Okay, you went there by a car. Okay, so here. Now, these are tunnel. These are the food and drinks vocabulary. These are the food and drinks vocabulary. Okay, so by the way, Tona, wait me. Okay, can we have our class for two class today? Just a sample 10. Can we end up at 11.45? 
So we have two class. We will not have class in the afternoon. We will go to two class together. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So we we don't have class in the afternoon. Let us go. Ah, uh, what the, what what do you mean? Ah, uh, what? How do I say that? Ah, uh, let us one class and then after class next. Okay. Continue. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So we don't have class in the afternoon. Okay. Food and drinks vocabulary. We have butter, cheese. Ice cream, milk, sour cream. These are the food and drinks. Okay. What is your favorite food in here? Okay, food. Give me your favorite food. My favorite food, food is mushroom. My favorite food are mushroom and noodles. Okay. It's mushrooms and noodles. Where is mushrooms here? Why do you like mushrooms and noodles? Mm, mushroom and it's very good and good have for me and noodle. It, noodles. Is, noodles. Noodles. Noodle is delicious. Delicious. Okay. So you like mush? How about salad? Do you like salad? Yes. It. Wow. Good. You like it? Yes. Wow. Okay. So next one. How about drinks? What is your favorite drink, Tono? My favorite drink is coffee and juice. Coffee and? Juice. Juice. Okay. You like coffee and juice. Okay. Next one. Okay. We have here. Phrasal verbs, okay? Phrasal verbs, it means to eat a lot of food at one time. Like pig out, okay? This is pig out. Pig out, it means to eat a lot of food at one time. You will eat a lot. Okay, you will eat a lot. Pig out. You eat a lot of food at one time. Whip up to quickly make a meal or something to eat. Whip up, it means to quickly make a meal or something to eat. Okay, whip up. So when you hear the word, this phrasal verb, when you hear these words, whip up, it means quickly make a meal or something to eat. Okay, next. Okay. Cut back on. What is cut back on? Please read Banong. To eat or drink less or of something. Okay. If you eat or drink less, means you will not eat a lot, you will not drink a lot, it's only less. So we call it cut back, back on. on. Okay. Another dig in. What do you mean by dig in? Dig in is to begin eating with enthusiasm. Okay. It means to begin eating with um, eating with enthusiasm. Okay. Enthusiasm. 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 Again. Enthusiasm. Enthusiasm. Okay. Enthusiasm. It means you are happy. When you eat, when you eat, you are very happy. You make it fast. So that is dig in in phrasal verb. Okay. Dig in in phrasal verb. How about to eat a small amount of food? Usually slowly. Okay. It means pick, 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 pick up, up. It means to eat small amount of food, usually slowly. You eat slowly, very slow. Okay. Take out. What do you mean by take out? It means to go to a restaurant, club, event with someone you invited. It means to take out, take out, to go to a restaurant, a club, or event with someone you invited. That is take out, okay? Yes. Okay. okay so again, okay, wait me, wait me. Ah, it's raining outside.
Okay, next one, we have the word. Okay, next one, we have the word. Okay, wait, pig out. What do you mean by pig out again? It's to eat a lot of food at one time. Okay, eating a lot of food, pig out. To quickly make a meal or something to eat. You will? Okay, you will say, Tono. Oh, oh, mom, I have to whip up. Oh, you will say your mom. Mom, I have to whip up. It means you will make a meal. Quickly meal. Okay, whip up. Whip up, it's a very nice. Okay, whip up. Yeah, whip up. So it means you will gonna eat something quickly. Like you will say, oh, I'm gonna whip up. Okay, whip up, it means quickly make a meal. Okay, like noodles, when you try to have noodles, it's whip up. Okay, to eat or drink less. Okay, it means... Cut back on. Okay, it is cut back on. Okay, whip up, quickly make a meal. Okay, cut back on, it means you will have to drink less. Okay, you will not eat a lot. Okay, I am on cut back on. Okay, to begin eating with enthusiasm, like dig in. Okay, dig in. To eat small amount of food, usually slowly. You will pick up. Pick up. Okay. You will say, "Oh, why do you? Why are you picking up?" So it means why you're eating small amount of food. Okay. Take mm -hmm. out to go to restaurant, club, event. Okay, with someone you invited. Take out. Okay. Next one we have here. Okay, your family, Tono, are going on a holiday for a several days. And your parents are thinking about accommodations. Talk together about the advantages of each accommodation and produce what is the most suitable for your family. Here is the picture with some ideas to help you. Okay, so which do you think? A hotel, this one, or a homestay? Which do you choose? To stay with the parents. Which do you choose to stay with your parents? Mm, is a hotel. Okay. Okay. It's the hotel? Yes. Okay. Why do you choose a hotel? Mm, because it's Beautiful and good. Okay, it is beautiful and good. Good, okay. So how about homestay? It's also it's like a home. Mm, homestay is good, but I think it's more than the room is more than the room in hotel. Okay, it is a uh, more comfortable if you stay in the hotel because hotel is big. Maybe it's a big, right? Okay. So homestay, it could be uh if homestay it could be someone, there's someone who will going to take care of you, or you will be the one to take care of yourselves. Okay, you are gonna bring uh some other homestay to know you can bring food inside. Okay, you can eat inside. Okay, so here is you are going to check the price. A price. Maybe in the hotel, it's too expensive. Location. Okay, you have to check if the location is just near to the uh, to the places that you want to stay. Okay, how about food and meals? The food tono, the service, and the experience with the people. Okay. Okay, so this one. Can you please describe me this one? Please look at picture one and describe. Picture one, I think, is expensive. But it's a, it's a trip. It's a fun trip. Okay. Okay, it's all. Uh, what do you think is this? What do you think they are doing? They is. They is. Mm -hmm. 
Moving. Okay, what do you think they're doing? I think they is moving. Okay, what this what do you think uh they are moving? They are doing. I think they is they are they are moving. They are rowing up? Oh, Oh, do you think this is dangerous? Mm, sometimes it's dangerous, but it's a fun trip. Okay, yeah. Okay, sometimes it is dangerous, teacher, but it is actually a fun trip. Okay, it's a fun trip. Okay, it's a fun trip. It's dangerous, but actually it is a fun trip. But if the water is very... Uh, what they call the one very fast. The water is very fast. So it is not advisable to have like this. This is not good. So what can you see around? Oh no, look up. Here. I see around is a mountain and many tree and rock. Okay. Mountain and groups. Okay. A group of people who are wearing lap jackets and holding paddles in your hand. This paddle, oh no, this one. This yeah. is paddle, okay? So, they go rafting in the river. What do you call what they're doing? They are? Yeah, are rafting in the river. Okay, it's rafting. Okay, rafting in the river. Rafting. This point is rafting. Okay, next. In the background, there is a mountain. In the background, there is a Mountain. Mountain. Yes. And, okay, that's all. Picture number two. What can you see in the picture number two? Uh, I think I see a lot of uh, people. There are tennis and people are reading as well. In the program, the uh, busy is a Lazarus judge. Yeah. Okay. So, lots of people on the deck. I guess this is a cruise ship. Okay, this is a cruise ship. They are traveling around the world. They are tanning. Look at this. It's very hot, but they want to tan. Do you know the word tan? It means white people wants to be brown. They are tanning. They want to make brown. Oh, you know the word tan, Tono? Yes. Okay, tanning, it means you want to be, you want your skin to be brown. They are tanning. Okay. Some people are ready. Oh, they are reading. Well, they are reading. Well, look at that in the picture. They are reading. Okay. Mm -hmm. In the background, you can see what you can see in the background. Is the sea. The sea. Okay. It's so scary. Do you like? To, to ride in the cruise ship? Mm, yeah. I think I like very it. much. Yes. yes. I think I like, I will like it very much. Okay, again. Do you like to ride in the cruise ship? I, I think I like it very much. Okay. Please remember it, Tono, huh? When you answer questions, when you answer. Okay, I think I like it. Don't say I I, be, I I like very much, okay? I think I like it very much, okay? You can say, I like it very much, that would be okay. But there is a word that I very like it. Oh, don't use the word I very like it, okay? It is wrong. Don't use the word I very like it, teacher. You will say, I like it very much, okay? okay. Next one. Okay, so talk together about where you like to go on holiday and what kind of activities do you want to go, okay? So, Tono, I will ask you, what is your most favorite place yet that you dream, dream place that you want to go? Mm, I want to go Hanoi. Ah, uh, 
Are you far from Hanoi? Yes, Hanoi is in the north of Vietnam. Ah, ah, Hanoi, north and then north, okay? Yes. North, south, east, west, okay, north. And then how about Danang? Where is Danang? In the middle? Yes, Danang is in the central of Vietnam. Vietnam. Okay, and Ho Chi Minh? Ho Chi Minh is in the south of Vietnam. Vietnam. So you're in the middle. You're in the middle. Yes. Okay. So Ho Chi Minh going to Hanoi is very far. So how many hours when you travel by a plane? I think it's a few hours. Okay. It is a hours. Okay. So like my car, uh, my place Tono is Bohol. Bohol is like Danang. It's in Central, Central of the Philippines. Okay, the capital is in the north, like Hanoi. So we're gonna travel to Manila like one hour, almost one hour and a half, like that. One hour and a half, we will be in Manila. Like one hour and thirty minutes, we will be in Manila when we ride a plane. Manila is a big city, like Hanoi. Okay, why do you want to go to Hanoi? Because it's beautiful and have a big market. Okay, it is beautiful and and the people in there are very friendly. Okay, it is very right. People live in there very friendly. Okay, the people who live in there are very friendly oh how about danang is a city right danang is a city oh yes. it is a big city danang is it a big city yes mm -hmm. me is living in danang yes messi, I... messi is living in danang yes yeah we started class with messi already like we already have four classes mm. yeah messi 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 is a fun boy. Yes. Yeah, he is so nice. He is fun boy like you who always smile. Okay. So are you classmates or no? No, because I live in Lingqiu District. Messi is living in Haichau District. Okay, in the different district. Yes. Okay. Okay. So, but your school, you have the same school or no? No. Oh, I, how did how did you know Messi? Messi, my dad has met his dad met Messi dad and and your dad and Messi's dad are friends. Go. When I went to Nacham, I met Messi. And, okay. and I and Messi met a friend. Oh, make friends. And what did you tell to Messi? Uh, what, what, why Messi uh, asked me to teach him? Or the mother? Mm, mother? Messi mother? Yeah, Messi's mother asked me to teach Messi. How did how did she know? How did the mother of Messi know knew that I am your teacher? Mm, Messi mother, I don't know see what she do, but I think she's kind and she's funny too. Yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, how did uh how did she know that I am your teacher? Mm, I told she about you. Oh, you told the mother? Yes. Oh, you told the mother? What did you say? <laughs> I say I have a good, a best teacher is teacher me, and she is funny and she always is tell me many good things. And then? So she said, oh, I will study. Yes. Oh, Messi is a funny boy, no? 
she is a funny boy. She always laugh and she always smile. <laughs> yes, but oh, I really thought, but you're living in Danang, the same. Yes. Okay. So yes. the reason why you want to stay Hanoi is Hanoi has beautiful places. Okay. What do you think the activity that you will do in Hanoi? Mm, I because Hanoi has many beautiful places. Mm -hmm. What you will do in Hanoi? I I go to a market and I go travel around. Okay, you will go to a market and travel around. Okay. So this is Hanoi is the best thing for you. Okay? Let us have here another activity. Okay, so we have here, we have vocabulary to know. Okay. What okay, we have the word bald. Oh, look at the word bald. It means don't have hair. Okay. You can see someone like this. That's bald. Okay, bald. Okay, don't have hair. Okay, next one. We have mustache. Okay. okay can you please read? Bald. Bald. Mustache. Mustache. Okay, mustache. Okay, this one. The one you put here. Okay, you can see. Have you seen mustache? Yes. Okay, your father has mustache or no? Um, my father has a mustache. Okay. Lawn. This is the lawn. Okay, outside your house. Do you have lawn? By the way, Tono, are you living in a house or in uh in a flat? I in my house. Oh, house, not a flat. Yes. Okay. So shade. Shade is this one. This is the shade of the tree. When it is very hot, Tono, you will go under the shade of the tree so that it will not be very hot. Shade of the tree, okay? This okay. is shade. Oh, it's very windy. Uh, this is the tree and you will be here. It's very Windy, okay? So it's very hot. Today, the weather in Philippines is hot. Sometimes it rain and it will be hot again. Oh. Okay. Yeah, Tono. That's why uh, we can easily seek today. There is... Yeah. Okay, now let us have this. Please listen properly, okay? Okay. I will hide this floating panels. Ready? Look at the three pictures for question one now. Now we are ready to start. Listen carefully. You will hear each recording twice. One. When and where are they meeting? What time are we meeting Jane? At half past seven. Outside the restaurant. I told her to wait inside, at a table. I know, but she said she'd prefer to meet us outside. Now listen again. What time are we meeting Jane? At half past seven, outside the restaurant. I told her to wait inside, at a table. I know, but she said she'd prefer to meet us outside. Two, what will Chris get for his birthday? It's Chris's birthday on Friday. What shall we get him? Mm, it's difficult. Tapes, CDs, but he's already got a lot of those. We could get him something to wear. No, let's get him a book on sport. He's really keen on that. Why not? Now listen again. It's Chris's birthday on Friday. 
What shall we get him? Mm, it's difficult. Tapes, CDs. But he's already got a lot of those. We could get him something to wear. No, let's get him a book on sport. He's really keen on that. Why not? Three. What does Mr. Jones look like? So could you describe Mr. Jones for me, please, madam? Well, he's about 40 years old, bald, with a moustache. He's got large ears and he wears glasses. Now listen again. So could you describe Mr. Jones for me, please, madam? Well, he's about 40 years old, bald, with a moustache. He's got large ears and he wears glasses. Four. Where is he going to plant the tree? Where are you going to plant the tree? By the front door? No, that would be silly. It'll grow too big. I'm going to put it at the back of the garage. When it's grown, it'll give us some shade in the summer. I thought it would be better right at the other end of the lawn. Oh, no. Now listen again. Where are you going to plant the tree? By the front door? No, that would be silly. It'll grow too big. I'm going to put it at the back of the garage. When it's grown, it'll give us some shade in the summer. I thought it would be better right at the other end of the lawn. Oh, no. Five. What is the man going to buy? Shall I get some fruit for the picnic? Yes. Can you get some oranges and bananas? I'm not very keen on oranges. How about grapes instead? They're so expensive at the moment. Just get the bananas. Now listen again. Shall I get some fruit for the picnic? Yes. Can you get some oranges and bananas? I'm not very keen on oranges. How about grapes instead? They're so expensive at the moment. Just get the bananas. Six. Which is Gary's room? Look, Gary sent us a postcard of his hotel, and he's put a cross to show us his window. Ah, right in the middle. Yes. He says he wanted a room on the top floor, but the only room available was on the floor below that. Now listen again. Look, Gary sent us a postcard of his hotel, and he's put a cross to show us his window. Ah, right in the middle. Yes. He says he wanted a room on the top floor, but the only room available was on the floor below that. Seven. Which is the best vehicle for the man? Good morning, sir. How can I help you? Well, I'd like to hire a car, please. Something fast and comfortable, with enough room for four adults and a child. Now listen again. Good morning, sir. How can I help you? Well, I'd like to hire a car, please. Something fast and comfortable, with enough room for four adults and a child. That is the end of part one. And finish picture. Yes, number one. When and where are all the meetings? When and where are all are they meeting? When? And where? In the? Yes, let us see. Let us see in the restaurant. Correct. What will Chris get for his birthday? What will Chris get for his birthday? Yes, let us see. Okay, let us see. 
what does Mr. Jones look like? What yes. does Mr. Jones look like? It's letter A. It's letter A. Oh, it's letter C. Bald with a mustache. Okay, bald with a mustache. Okay. Where is he going to plant the tree? Where is Mr. Jones plant the tree? Where? It's letter A. Okay, letter A. Let me check. Correct. Okay. Number five, Dono. What is the man going to buy? Yes, letter C. Letter C. Okay, letter C. Wait, wait. Say, what is it's letter C. Okay, very good. We, oh, what is letter C? What fruit is this? It's some banana. Okay, banana. Which is Gary's room? It's letter B. B on the top. It's letter A. How about which is oh, wait me to know how my dog is eating something? Okay. Okay. Now, which is the best vehicle for the man? A, B, or C? Is letter B. Okay, are you sure it's letter B? Vehicle for the man. Okay. Yes, letter B. B? Oh, you choose. The answer is letter A. It's the 